I swear, half my life in track. Hey, Slick, it's me! <laughs> what the fuck do you want? You got my money, punk? Hey, you got some coconut water or something like that? I need some electrolytes. Damn, it's kind of warm, isn't it? <sighs> Man, you got a death wish or something. Am I supposed to kill you now? Oh, no, bro. Not me. Nah. Oh, yeah! But that's my boy. Yeah, but that's my boy. He has betrayed everyone he's ever known. He's got you involved with the federal government, and he's messed up several business ventures of mine. He has got to go. And you know what? I'd like to say that this isn't personal, but it is personal. But the feds, man. The feds have told me to kill Trevor, and I obviously can't kill them both. The feds. Steve Haynes, Dave Norton. I own shopping malls. I would not employ those two clowns in. And I make one phone call, their careers, they are over. So you're going to A, listen to some 50 grand a year pension hunter, or B, a billionaire, who even the president lets finger his wife, or C, try and be really stupid and save those two idiot mentors of yours and have everybody in the goddamn state crawling up your ass. A, B, or C. Time's ticking, pal. Beep, beep, beep. And your answer is... Man, you know what? Man, fuck you. <laughs> genius answer, pal. Total genius, but time is running. You think about it. Me, I got a triathlon coming up, and I am in deep training. Bye bye Man, fuck you. Franklin, what's up? Shit, what's cracking, homie? We need to talk, but somewhere quiet, all right? Yeah, sure, man. Whatever you need. How about one of those empty lots off El Burro, on the east side of town? Yeah, all right, homie. Look, I'll meet you there, all right? What's up, big homie? Mike, man, 
I need to have a conversation with Trevor. You know? Yeah, that conversation. Oh, shit. All right, okay. Look, man, the FIB dudes want him gone. And Devin Weston want y'all gone. You know how it is, dawg. Shit. Somebody gotta go. Oh, well, it ain't fucking me. Exactly, man. Look, we meeting at a Borough Heights. So you think you can help me? Uh, I don't know. That sounds like it's your thing, Frank. I I'll see what I can do. I got ten bucks says someone's gonna get a little drive by tonight. Hey, man, how you doing? Shit, I'm good, T. And yourself? <sighs> Peachy! I know what this is about. You do? Of course! It's Michael! You're the peacemaker! Well, I ain't having it, all right? I ain't having it. I mean, maybe when the heat dies down. But this, nah, I ain't having it. I mean, that's it, right? Huh? Wasn't it? Wasn't it? But Michael ain't the problem. T, I like you. You scare the shit out of me sometimes. You creep me the fuck out. But, but the way I see it, the way anyone normal will see it, not that any of this shit is normal, man, you gonna get us all fucking killed. You gonna whack me? Huh? Me? I ain't been nothing but straight and true with you. I'm sorry, man. Yeah, you have been true with me. But the truth ain't what I'm interested in. You fucking shooter!
talk. Hey, Trevor! Hey, let's do this in a quiet place, homie. Chasing T through the oil field. Shit. Okay. I'm not far away. Try and stop him. Oh. 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 
You know what, tough guy? It's... It's time you grow the fuck up. I mean, I admit, I'm a bad piece of work, but that guy, that piece of shit, no boundaries, no sense of when to back off, no nothing. 24-7 insanity, day in, day out, all the time. Never regretted nothing, never cared for nothing. Well, fuck him. I mean, there's got to be a limit, kid. You know, a point where even assholes like us say, enough is he fucking enough. Human stew. That's my limit. I know that now. I guess that's that, Dean. It is what it is. Hey! It's certainly been an education. Surviving is winning, Franklin. Everything else is bullshit. Fairy tales spun by people afraid to look life in the eye. Whatever it takes, kid. Survive. Damn straight. 